Before we start thinking about our model as coastal engineers, we need to define the area that we want to study. In environmental science, when we think about systems, we're usually talking about ecosystems. Environmental and coastal engineers think about the world a little differently. Rather than studying interactions or changes within an ecosystem, we want to set boundaries on what we want to study. As we set those boundaries, we also want to make sure we can use mathematics to help explain the relationships between different factors in our system. Think back to the problem statement that your project team created at the end of session one. How would you define the system that we want to study? Is it a physical place? What boundaries would you put on it? What could you measure to mathematically assess how the beach is changing? Take a few minutes to think or talk through how we might define the system that we want to study. Then, when you're ready, I'll share our thoughts on our approach.